May Edochi makes big announcement. Yola Edochi and Judy Austin surprised. Hello, Nigerians. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. You know, Yola Edochi didn't even know that May Edochi, you know, she's a very smart and a very calculative lady. You know, sometimes some people take what they have for granted. And, you know, they don't even know that, know that a lady's submissiveness does not mean that the lady is weak. This is what most men don't really understand. That a lady is submissive to you does not mean she's not weak or probably she doesn't know her rights. She's just trying to be submissive, you know, to ensure that the marriage works and you people know, coexist or live peacefully. And but most men, you know, misunderstand this particular this, and they use that opportunity to intimidate their wife and do all sorts of things because they think that whatever they do, they can go scot free because their wives are submissive. And this is what gave you know, the the impetus to do what he did. You know, because Meidochi was all this why that that they have been married. Meidochi was loyal, obedient, and submissive to Yeladechi. So Yeladechi never even appreciated what that lady was doing. Rather, he wanted to take advantage of that to 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 to, to do other things that other illegal things that he, he wanted to do. And that is what he did, you know, without any iota of fear or respect for his wife. He the dating went and you know impregnated Judy Austin. In fact, he was having affairs with Judy Austin for the past 12 years. Out of the 18 years that he has been married, he was having affairs with Judy Austin for 12 years because he thinks that his wife cannot do anything because he has seen that his wife is submissive and loyal to him. So he thinks that that is a free ticket to do anything. Probably at the end of the day, his wife will still remain submissive to him. Without knowing that there is always a, 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 an elastic limit to every lady. There is a place you push a lady, a lady will tell you that enough is enough. The lady will tell you that enough is enough. That is why the lady even had the F13 because his wife was submissive. He had the F13 to go and be mingling with Jude Austin, got Jude Austin pregnant without letting his wife know. You know, went and even took his kinsmen and his family, uh, the Peter Doche and his mother, and went to Jude Austin's village and paid her bride price. You know, without telling his wife, who oh, stay yet after doing all those things secretly, he will still come back to the same house and sleep under the same room with his wife, May Doche. If you see the level of disrespect, and he never intended to tell his wife, oh, not until 2020, his wife only discovered this thing after this lover exposed the secret or exposed the information. So you could see that he, then he surely took May Doche for granted because the lady was submissive to her. Had it been he got a very crazy type or probably a lady that was not sub submissive, by now he couldn't even, he wouldn't have had the F1 trip. So this is what most men do. You know, when their ladies or when their wives are submissive and very loyal and less dramatic and less controversial, instead of some men to appreciate it and even use that particular opportunity or attitude to love their wife, rather they want to take advantage of that submissiveness to, you know, hurt their wife and, you know, betray their wives. Later they will come and fake an apology to their wife, thinking that probably any apology they fake that their wife will accept it. And this is what you know, the did. You know, after intentionally doing what he did, because for him to impregnate with Austin and uh, get her pregnant and went and paid that uh, bride price, it was not accidental. It was not really accidental. It was a, a way orchestrated and intentional act. So he thought that after doing it, he would, he would just send an apology to Medoche uh, and Medoche would uh, forgive him. That is why he had the F1 and impetus to be doing what he was doing. And, and if you watch, that, that is what he did. Uh, towards December period, he now sent an apology to his to me, Doji, telling me Doji, that he is sorry, that nobody is coming to disrespect her, nobody is coming to take her position. You know, he wants to cajole the lady. You know, he has seen that me, Doji, is a very uh, respectful and submissive woman. So he, he thinks that probably anytime he hears, anytime he sees, or probably anytime he does something bad, and he can easily go to his wife and say, baby, I'm sorry, or probably my wife, I'm sorry, then uh, the wife will forgive him like that. It doesn't work that way. What he did was a very big offense. It's not like any other thing that the, the lady can easily forgive or forget. It's not easy. He can do other things. He can even cheat, uh, probably anything. But it's not all about bringing the receipt. You had a receipt of your cheating. You had a son, and the lady cannot even. Uh, you did not even give the lady time to even try to, you know, uh, uh, cool her head down. See, yet we are bragging. You are a proud polygamist. You are this. You are that. You are this. You are that. You can see that how you know, the used his own hands to spoil his own marriage. It's 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 really 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 there. So because of all those things, May Doche really really now came out and showed May Doche that she's not a dumb and she's not dumb. That she knows her right. Despite her submissiveness and her loyalty to him, it does not mean that she doesn't know her right. So she has actually shown you the Doche, you the Doche that she knows her right. Initially last year she told you the Doche that she will never be cajoled and neither will she be numbered as a wife in the house that she built together with her. And you also will never cross into that particular mansion. These were just her laws and the conditions she gave to you, you, the DJ, you know, and you, the DJ, was surprised because he never thought that me, the would give him such kind of conditions and tough time. You know, he thought that probably is, is something that would go easy. Maybe after apologizing to her, she will now accept, you know, without knowing that me, the would actually maintain that standard uh, uh, position. I love that. I really love that. You know, recently, me, the teased our fans. You know, a lot of people love this lady. A lot of people love her. A lot of people are wishing her well. I must tell you for the fact, a lot of people, even some men.
Men are even ready to marry her again, even after having four children with this uh, this thing. People love her attitude, her character, her calmness, and her submissiveness. You know, recently she said something that she's going to, that is a big announcement that is coming soon. And you know, a lot of people are so curious to know what this big announcement is all about, whether it's an endorsement view or whether he has, she has finally divorced you the because a lot of people are predicting that uh, this year might not really go far before we may the will divorce you the because the way you the has been acting not being remorseful, not being so proud and full of himself, you know, there is every tendency that they might actually divorce. So a lot of people are waiting, or if it's Sarah Martins, you know, this um, Dublin lady being made, which is sued by one Judy Austin's friend that, that, that Judy Austin uh, recruited to insult her, you know, being Sarah Martins. So we don't know whether that, that is the big announcement. Probably that Sarah Martins has tendered an apology, or probably she has been arrested, and, uh, or probably anything. We don't know. But I believe that the big announcement will definitely come, and I will keep on updating you guys about the big announcement that she's about to make. But I believe that any big announcement she's going to make will be something good and something positive, because nothing bad comes from that lady. I must tell you for the fact, everything she speaks, everything she does, everything everything she does is all about positive something, you know. So it it, it could be either and uh, uh, probably with her with regards to her, the announcement might be probably with regards to her marital life, or she has back there another big endorsement deal. Only God knows. I must tell you, or probably only God knows whether suitors are coming for her. But I believe that she is, she, she is not in the haste to you know, get uh, remarry or probably have an affair with another man. She's a very decent and a very disciplined lady. Well, I'd like you guys to drop your comment on my social and equally subscribe to my YouTube channel.